Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Cyril Sanan. This is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing Arrow. And we're doing the season four, episode 20, which is called Genesis. So we start off with Hive Fallout. So basically Dark comes, goes back to the Hive headquarters and he literally kills everybody. That was part of Hive. So it's just him and then his crew, which is Malcolm and whoever else he brought in. I think the, the murmur guy, the one with his mouth, his mouth showed up sewed up and then we cut to Oliver um, was, was I guess talking to Constantine on how to combat the darkness and he think he found a way to do that so he has to go to Hub City for a few days and then Thea also asks for time off because she is break from all this craziness and then so he just kind of tells like everyone just take a beat take a break because um, the good stuff not been around so just kind of don't worry about it right now and so, um, Dig visits Lila, and she's in a bunker, which is actually a day team wheeler. <laughs> so they're constantly moving around. Then we have Felicity, uh, and tries to cheer Oliver up, and it's not really working that great, but she does decide to go with him to Hub City. So, um, she goes with him, and then we, um, then Diggle's, um, knows that Andy has been spotted, so it's, then it's Andy versus Diggle. As um, Andy went out to go get um, baby supplies for baby Sarah. So then it's Andy versus Diggle. Like I said, that Andy gets away. And then we cut to Oliver and Felicity go gambling. And we and Felicity loves to gamble because it's basically just counting cards. And she's super smart like that. So she keeps winning. And then uh, Thea freaks out a little bit because she literally just... Um, first she was driving. And the next thing she knows, she's waking up or... Alex is driving and then Thea just literally wakes up in this weird house and she's calling out his name he's not answering so she's really freaked out and she doesn't remember getting there so then she finds Alex and then she relaxes and then um, then they and then we cut to Oliver and Felicity they find the person and she's a really beautiful girl or woman and she's a shaman and then we cut to where Andy set a trap for Diggle because Diggle goes after Andy and then Diggle tries to guilt him, but it doesn't work. And he actually, um, Andy actually tortures Diggle. And then, so then we cut to where the shaman is explaining things. And there is an idol chamber. And there is one in Star City. So he needs to channel uh, Light and Hood to combat the light and the darkness. Sorry, I just lost some pulling up. I was like, don't know. <laughs> So anyway, um, he needs to channel light and dark, um, light and hope to combat the uh, darkness and the despair from dark. Because if it doesn't work, it'll make dark more powerful. So then we cut to Thea and Alex going to walk, and Thea thinks there's something off, and then she notices that the sound is on a loop. It's not that great. And so then, um, then we cut to where Diggle almost kills Andy. And then we cut to the shaman test. And it works the first time. It works pretty good. He was able, able to counteract it. And the shaman says, like, well, this is just like a baby step. So I'm going to hit you with something much harder. And that one does not go well at all. I mean, at all. And now there's, there's really nothing that the shaman can do anything about it. Because her impression is if you are... If you do bad on the second test, there's really no help for you. You can't turn around in like a week or two. You have to continually work on it. So then we cut to where Thea is weirded out. And then we find out Alex is just is taking those pills that Adams gave her. And it's Vicar making him compliant and kind of a ditz. So then we cut to uh, Lila. Louis fusses Dickle out when he returns back. And we find out that Andy really put a tracker on Diggle. So the ghost plus Andy attack the Argus truck and they can withstand it because it's like bulletproof and everything is like pretty awesome about that truck, that 18 wheeler. But the one thing it can't do is protect them from dark and that's when dark shows up. So he starts the truck and they're about to infiltrate then Diggle literally takes baby Sarah and has them has her on a motorcycle and they pop out and leave 
So Andy and the ghosts go after um, Diggle. And then, um, then we cut to Felicity hit him with his with the van. So um, then Oliver helps out as well. And then it's Diggle versus Andy again. And they, it, Diggle's trying to find Andy. And then Oliver combats the dark. And then Diggle uh, finds Andy and kills him because he's because Andy kept on taunting him, saying, "I'm gonna." Do- What's gonna happen? I'm gonna keep on finding you. I'm gonna find your family. I'm gonna kill them. So Diggle kills Andy. Then Oliver and Felicity talk and um, about repelling Dark, and he got through it by everyone telling him that he could do it and to never give up. Then Lila and Diggle talk about Andy and Andy. I mean, and then Diggle lied about how he killed Andy. Basically, he, instead of, like, Andy being kind of defenseless, he said that he pulled a gun on him, and it was self-defense, basically. So, Lila, of course, doesn't blame him for that, but he, still, but he feels guilty because that's not true. <laughs> and then we cut to, um, Dark took Rubicon out of Lila's arm. He knew it was there and literally ripped, um, sucked it out, ripped it out. And so the um, Lila goes over what Rubicon is, and it is a ballistic override nuke code. Ah. And then Thea is trying to escape uh, to where she is, and it turns out she's in an underground compound. And that's the end of the episode. So that was actually a pretty good episode. I actually uh, liked it. And Andy is dead, thank God, because I thought that was going to happen soon enough. <laughs> Took a while. But, um,. Really good episode. I'll give this an A plus. It was pretty good in my opinion, and I just like the kind of like the dynamic that um, Thea gets taken away on this underground compound, which is like a huge compound. But anyway, um, like I said, really good episode, and that's going to do it for this video. So if you like this video, please give it a like, comment down below on what you think, and subscribe for more stuff. And I want y'all have an awesome day, and I'll see y'all next video. Bye, everybody.